It's 10 trivia questions on true crime for Patreon subscriber Jenny Yetter. This is Trivia with Buds. What it be and welcome to another episode of the Trivia with Buds podcast. I'm your host, Ryan Buds. Thanks for checking out the show and thanks for all the support you guys have given me over these last 15 months recommending me for virtual trivia shows for your friends, your family, your coworkers. I've had some amazing clients and I was looking at my schedule this week. Shows for Amazon, Discover, Johnson & Johnson, and like three other amazing companies uh, all in one week. And that's thanks to word of mouth on what I do from you guys uh, that listen to the show and people who I've, I've done virtual trivia shows before and uh, physical in-person shows before, before the quarantine. Uh, I just wanted to say thank you so much for always uh, putting my name out there or saying, hey, I know a guy who does that. That seems to be the biggest way that I get these shows, someone goes, hey, someone was at your show and uh, you know, I, I was asking them, do you know anybody who does something like this? And they go, I was just at a show. A guy did that the other day. So just wanted to uh, really say thank you if you listen to the show and uh, if you've thrown my name out there. Very, very much appreciate it. You're helping feed my family here in Eastern Tennessee and uh, very grateful for that. We are going to do uh, 10 questions today on true crime, a topic that I usually stay away from. Uh, I don't like glorifying uh, serial killers and murderers and things, uh, but it's, you know, it is a part of history. So uh, we've got 10 questions here for Jenny Yetter. She picked these from uh, her topics on Patreon. She's a Patreon subscriber, and she said, hey, I'd love a true crime category. So here we are. And uh, we're going to do those 10 questions and see what you know about some true crime. If you want to pick your own categories for the whole year, you can do it once a month. Go to patreon.com slash trivia with buds. Join the group at $5 or higher. And uh, I'll send you the Google form where you can fill in all your topics. And I'll get to those at some point in the year. All right. We're going to jump to these 10 questions on true crime right now. And uh, here we go. It's true crime trivia. Question number one, the St. Valentine's Day Massacre is associated with what famous criminal? Number one, the St. Valentine's Day Massacre is associated with what famous criminal? True crime number one. Question number two, in what city did H.H. Holmes have a murder castle? Number two, in what city did H.H. Holmes have a murder castle? Number two. Number three, one of the biggest cases of the 90s, who was killed alongside Nicole Brown Simpson in 1994? Number three, who was killed alongside Nicole Brown Simpson in 1994? Number three. Question number four, Adnan Saeed was the focus of the first season of what 2014 podcast? Number four, Adnan Saeed was the focus of the first season of what 2014 podcast? Question number five, in what decade did the Black Dahlia murder occur? Number five, in what decade did the Black Dahlia murder occur? Question number six, in what state was Gianni Versace killed? In what state was Gianni Versace killed? Number six. Question number seven, a 50-50 question, who died first, Tupac or Biggie Smalls? Number seven, who died first, Tupac or Biggie Smalls? Number seven. Question number eight, what personality was fired from NBC in 2017 for sexual assault? Number eight, what personality was fired from NBC in 2017 for sexual assault? Number nine, what year did Princess Diana die? Number nine, what year did we lose Princess Diana? Number nine. And your final question for today's episode, what Superman actor was found dead of a single gunshot wound in 1959? Number 10, what Superman actor was found dead of a single gunshot wound in 1959? Those are all your questions on true crime trivia. We'll be right back in just a second with the verdict on the answers. 
It's true crime trivia for Jenny Yetter. Let's see if she got them all right. Here are the answers. Number one, the St. Valentine's Day Massacre is associated with which famous criminal? That is Al Capone. Number one, Al Capone. Number two, in what city did H.H. H. Holmes have a murder castle? That's another Al Capone city. Chicago. Number two, Chicago. I think Leonardo DiCaprio is supposed to play H.H. H. Holmes in a movie with Martin Scorsese directing. The Devil in the White City, something like that. Number three, who was killed alongside Nicole Brown Simpson in 1994? Ron Goldman. Number three, Ron Goldman. And number four, Adnan Saeed was the focus of the first season of what 2014 podcast? That was Serial. Number four, Serial. Number five, in what decade did the Black Dahlia murder occur? That was the 1940s. The 1940s. And number six, in what state was Gianni Versace killed? Florida, near Miami. Number six, Florida for Versace. Number seven, who died first, Tupac or Biggie Smalls? That was Tupac. And uh, I think it was six to nine months later that Biggie died. Number seven, Tupac. Number eight, what personality was fired from NBC in 2017 for sexual assault? Matt Lauer. Number eight, Matt Lauer. Number nine, what year did Princess Diana pass away? 1997 in that car crash. And number 10, what Superman actor was found dead of a single gunshot wound in 1959? That was George Reeves. George Reeves. And uh, I believe Ben Affleck plays that actor in a movie called Hollywood Land, if I'm not mistaken. But uh, those are all your questions for today's episode on true crime. Hopefully you got your fix, Jenny Yetter. She's really into true crime. And uh, we have a fact of the day for you. Tomato sauce was sold in the 1800s as medicine. Can you imagine slathering your body in tomato sauce to get rid of a flu? I don't know if people did that, but maybe. Tomato sauce, 1800s medicine. If you didn't know that, now you know. Thank you so much for listening to the podcast. Thanks for telling a friend about the podcast, and we'll see you next time for more trivia with Buds. Cheers.